Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to a rather chilly episode of the Tricky Brickies, where today we have come back from America. We have done a little job in Mersey Island in Essex, and now the Tricky travels again, and we are we in Wales, ladies and gentlemen. In the Welsh Valleys, and we're about to continue with a job which I started a few months ago. Yes, that's right, ladies and gentlemen. We are back over here on what was a video I did before known as the Big Block Job. There'll be a link for that in the description here, or maybe here. <laughs> so, anyway, our job is now that the bottom that we put on, all them heavy blocks that you can see in that video, you can now look. And as you can see, we've got a timber frame on top of it, all the way around. The roofs are here sticking the roof on it at the moment as well. So it's my job now to go around and skin it with block work on the outside of this timber frame. So without further ado, let's get some profiles up and get our first little course set out. Let's go. Right, happy days. So we've got little wooden profiles up that I managed to uh, make out of a bit of wood. And uh, we've run the first two courses in. We've got our cut insulation there now. So to get us back to bond, we're going. One of them please, Jamie. Now there we are, that's 525 off of the joist. Now with everything that's gone on it, that's now, that brings us back to floor level. So we're gonna put a block out all the way around. Then we're gonna start blocks all the way up and then it works to the top. Maybe. Haha, <laughs> well that's the idea anyway. So we're gonna get these blockettes on here now, carry on insulating up, and then we can carry on blocking up this front. Hopefully today we get all of this front done and a bit round the side. Fingers crossed. So there we go, that was day one. We got 250, 266 blocks down on the first day. That was with our dry start, not knowing really what was going on and insulated. So that's that lovely old job. So now we're gonna chase the building round. Took the profile down from that end. Now I've taken the profile down from this end. And we're gonna continue round now, round the building. We've got to sort out all this uh, insulation, get that all flat back to the wall. We're gonna use some, some sticky stuff. He's got some stuff in a tube. We're gonna stick on the back of that. That's the piece, the, the 300 piece between the joists, the awkward bit, the bit you've got to cut your insulation. So uh, we're gonna tack that back and then um, we're gonna carry on with the buttons as normal right the way up. So our plan today is to get around this flank, come down here, scaffolding. It's a bit dangerous, but that's what we've got. Poe's up, we come around this corner, sort these trays out as we go, and hopefully get up to this corner tonight. Oi, oi! Jamie on the mix, ladies and gentlemen. Chicka, chicka, chicka. <laughs> right then, let's crack on and get uh, get around this little dog leg bit today, see if we can get another 250, 300 blocks down today. Stay in front, lovely old job.
we go. We're getting a chunk on now. Big load of block work up. We've covered it in Hessian tonight, ladies and gentlemen, because you know what it's like in the winter. It's very cold at the moment. We don't want the frost attacking our muck. So we've covered up in Hessian to prevent that happening. Any frost that comes tonight will land on the Hessian and not on the wall. Plus, we're pretty lucky in a way. We've got a lot of scaffolding up, so a lot of it will hit that before it hits the wall. But just to be safe, Hessian right through. Lovely. Day two, done. There we go, there's that bit done. Another section complete. We've also chucked a tray in there underneath the blockette to seal up that cavity there and into the, into the inside floor. So that's lovely. So now we're carry on moving round. And now we're gonna come through this section here. It's all been insulated, ready to roll. We've got a window there, so we're gonna run this in. I'm gonna build that corner down there. Set some, I think I'll just build a hand, build a corner down there. I haven't got anything to set a profile up off of. So I'll hand build one there, get this corner racked in, and then we're on the home straight round the corner. There's Jamie, oi oi. Oi oi. Then we're on the home straight for the beginning of the first lift. Anyway, the, the first lift, the home straight is round here. <laughs> We've got another big door in it as well and a couple of windows. So yeah, lovely old job. We're getting around it, baby. Ha <laughs> ha. Day three, oi oi. So there we go. All the way from that far corner today around this dog leg and yes we did we made it we made it all the way around happy days three days down so now we're up on the top section of the scaffold now we can see the gables there's the end <laughs> right on this one we've got a lintel coming across this big opening here massive great opening obviously we've got to insulate this as well like we have everywhere else but what would they've asked us to do with this is because it's a it's a single skin lintel it's not a catnick it doesn't join in there's no block work for it to join onto the timber frame so what we have to do is we build up to the lintel level where the lintel height is i'm going to bed the lintel we're going to prop it in the middle then we put two courses of block work over the top let that go off once that's gone off, we can then put our tray on, up, nail it onto here, screw it on, tape it on, onto this wall, carry on with our insulation, and then go above. But we're gonna let that go off two courses first, get that nice and rigid, and gonna keep that prop up in the middle as well while we build it. And then once it's all gone off and gone strong, that'll stay up, lovely old job. <laughs> lovely old job. <laughs> there we go, we're up to lintel bearing now. Bosh. Good stuff, so the lintel's gonna come up in a minute, but first, it's time for some well-deserved f o d Let's go and get a KFC, baby. Chicken zinger winger, baby. <laughs> Day five in the Big Brother house. <laughs> yes, we're here now, Saturday morning. We're over here, it is really cold. The water pouring off the roof now as it's all defrosting in the sun. Icy baby. So we're making the most of uh, these couple of hours this morning. We're going to get bumped out through here. Bump out this gable. 
and hopefully by the time this is all bumped out we'll be ready to lay the sun's coming round this side it's going to be on this flank all day as well which is a help and i can feel the warmth in the sun so we're going to be all right to lay so yeah just this first couple of hours get this all loaded out and then we'll be happy days on the end of this flank so let's not muss around and get this loaded oi oi <laughs> Now, fresh Sunday morning. We've got a massive chunk done around here now, up on this top lift. <coughs> I've left this top block off so it's easier for us to get our insulation in right the way up to the top. We've got to put a pin in at this course as well, right the way through. So I've got one more course to put through there. I built it there at the corner though. So we're good there. And we've got this section of wall up right into the rafters i'm going to fall some muck into that bit there but we're right up tight <sighs> along there gosh so on a sunday the only bit i can back up today because all of our insulation gear i.e our wall ties our buttons and the tool we used to put the wall ties in are all locked inside there so I can't get to them. So the only place I can back up is this section here, which has already been insulated, tied and pinned. So I've set up a profile here in this corner. I'm gonna put some gauge marks from this block onto these. Same with this one here. And I'm gonna return it until I get to this little bearing, this height here, so I can return it and rack it back right up to full height. So on a Sunday, it's only about 80 blocks, 80, 90 blocks, something like that. So I'm gonna quickly rattle these out. And then Monday morning, we can crack on with the insulation, get these gables all finished up. Lovely old job. I can see the light now. We've done a big chunk of this next lift now. So yeah, gonna crack on today, get some more done. It's a big thing. Getting up in the morning, even on a Sunday, it's all about your attitude towards work. Whether you've, got the, whether you've got it in you to come out on a Sunday and make some money, or whether you're gonna stay in and chill. But for me, it's a day, it's a weekend where I've got to charge up my ass. I wanna succeed some, at something. I wanna succeed at something. So to do that, you've gotta get up and get on with it. So let's do it. we're four three courses up now ready to put our blockettes on the end blockette either side and then our lintels same round the corners of blockettes go on round there as well lovely let's go and get some food <laughs> so there we go that's that section all complete and wrapped up i managed to get a few blocks right up into there as well no small void now, the Suffolk comes in, in here as well, so we're well above that, which is good. <sighs> back back there, I've got my lintel bearing set up underneath the Hessian there. My lines are set up now to pull this through. I've set up the profile on this corner now, hard. And we can pull all the way through the front off of that line now as well. Got a few blocks stacked out here. Gonna need a few more. But we are definitely getting rounder now. Also, right the way round. And here again, where I, where I laid yesterday, I got the Hessian up. Keep it covered, it won't hurt to keep it covered. 
Woo wee! Lovely old job. Definitely a big old house. Yo. There we go, there's a gable done with a bat box in it. One done. Another two to go. So there we go, ladies and gentlemen. After eight days work, we're all in, bat boxes in everywhere. Right the way to the top, the job is complete. Fire socks, all in, stuffed in nice at the top. All the way around, all the gables. Lovely old job. This one right the way up to the top. Boom. <sighs> Wee poles over the lintels. It's getting rendered as soon as the weather turns a bit better. Oh dear. Wee. Round this side. All done through here. All fire socks up. All fire socks in there. Lovely. Let's go up the back box in there. We're all done, ladies and gents. Happy days. Wales job, big block build, complete. Oh yeah. So there we have it. The big block build. So on that note, ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much for watching this episode. Please don't forget to hit that thumbs up, hit that like, hit that subscribe, and hit that notification button as well, so you're informed whenever I upload a video. But until the next one, ladies and gentlemen, have a great Christmas, and I'll see you soon. Peace out, and... Ah! Ha <laughs> ha!